This is Mr. Martin. These are the video notes uh, for derivatives, uh, the derivatives packet. And uh, we've got a couple of more rules to talk about. We've got to talk about the product rule and the quotient rule. Um, so the product of two differentiable functions, u and v, is uh, differentiable. And um, d dx of u times v is equal to the function u times the derivative of function v plus the function v times the derivative of the function u. So let's take a look at an example and then uh, we'll let you try one. So I'm going to let my, and I like to label all of my uh, parts here so that it makes it a lot easier and uh, I'll make less mistakes. So my function u is going to be x squared plus 1 and my derivative of u du dx so I'm going to use my power rule so it's going to be uh, 2x to the first or just 2x plus 0 so it's just going to end up to be 2x and my function v is x cubed plus 3 so my dv dx my derivative of uh, the function v is going to be 3x squared so now I've got all my pieces so I know that uh, f prime of x is going to be the derivative I'm sorry, it's going to be u times dv dx plus v times du dx. All right, and I've got all my parts up here, so I'm just going to substitute those in. So uh, u is going to be x squared plus 1. dv dx, that's my derivative of uh, v with respect to x, so that's going to be times 3x squared plus my function v, which is x cubed plus 3, times du dx, du dx is 2x, times 2x. And then I'm going to do a little simplifying, so uh, distribute this. So I've got 3x to the fourth plus 3x squared. And then I'm going to distribute over here too, so plus 2x to the fourth plus 6x. And then um, a little more simplifying, combining like terms, I end up with 5x to the fourth plus 3x squared plus 6x. Okay, so there's my um, product rule in action. So um, moving on to the next example, here's another function uh, similar. Um, so go ahead and pause the video and uh, try this one out and um, and see how you do. Alright, so here's uh, the solution to the you try it. So here's my function u, which is x plus 1, so the derivative is just going to be 1. And here's my function v, so the derivative of that is going to be 3x squared. So here's my uh, product rule. I've got u times dv dx plus v times du dx. And then substituting all my pieces from here, and then doing a little simplifying, and hopefully you got 4x cubed plus 3x squared plus 2. Alright, moving on to the quotient rule. So at a point where v does not equal 0, because we've got v in the denominator here, the quotient y equals u over v of two differentiable functions is differentiable and um, our quotient rule over here we've got v du dx minus u dv dx so um, similar to the other one but a little bit different and then we we're going to divide it by uh, v squared so again I'm going to write down all my parts here so for u I'm going to have x squared plus 1 and for du dx I'm going to differentiate that that's going to be 2x. And then for v, I'm going to have x squared plus 1. So dv dx is going to be 2x. And I know that uh, d dx of u divided by v is going to be v times du dx minus u times dv dx all over v squared substituting everything 
I've got uh, x squared plus 1 times 2x minus uh, x squared plus 1, that's my u function, times dv dx, which is 2x also. And this is all going to be over my v function squared, which is x squared plus 1 squared. So we've got a little bit of simplifying to do. So I'm going to distribute over here. So I have 2x cubed plus 2x. And then distribute over here. I've also got the minus in the front to take care of. So that's going to be minus 2x cubed minus 2x. Um, let's see. This should be, I've got one of these wrong up here. This should be minus over here, x squared minus 1, which would make this, sorry about that guys, minus 1 over there, which I have minus a negative, which would make that plus. And then this is all going to be over x squared plus 1 squared. So I've got 2x cubed minus 2x cubed there, and then in the numerator I have 4x and that's all over x squared plus 1 squared. And there is our final answer. OK, so um, for the you try it over here, um, what I would recommend to start out is uh, if you recognize this, this is um, a cubed minus b cubed. Um, so if we foil or uh, multiply this back out, we're going to end up with x cubed minus 1. So I would recommend doing that first. So then your u is going to be x cubed minus 1, and your v is going to be x cubed. So if you want to uh, go ahead and try the rest of it on your own, go ahead and pause the video. Otherwise, when you uh, restart, the solution will be there uh, waiting for you. All right, so here's the rest of the solution. Um, if you need to uh, pause this and take a look and compare to yours, go ahead and do that. Um, you should have gotten 3 over x to the 4th. Um, if you, again, if you have any questions, make sure that you ask. Um, uh, make sure you also know these uh, rules uh, for the next assessment. And uh, again, if you have any questions, make sure you ask them or uh, write them down and ask them the next time you see me. That's it for this one.